This is Melissa. She's excited to see that Baby Gap is having a sale. This is Jen. She also loves Baby Gap. Melissa drives quickly to the mall and is on the hunt for a parking spot. No way she's paying the valet fee when she can park herself, but it still takes her 15 minutes to find a spot. Jen also hops into her car and drives to the mall at lightning speed. No valet for her. It's too difficult with kids. Because Jen has sure spot, she doesn't have to drive around looking for a parking spot. She pulls right into her assigned space. Jen's excited for the sale and her Starbucks coupon redemption. When Melissa arrives, the sale racks are completely empty. She asks a store employee about the sale and he tells her they just sold out. Apparently, Jen purchased the last of the sale merchandise. Even though both women left at the same time, Melissa's stuck buying her items at full price. It's an unsuccessful shopping trip for Melissa, and her day only gets worse when she realizes she doesn't remember where she parked her car. Jen doesn't have to worry about where she parked. She's out of there in no time. Jen gets home and tells her husband about her day. When Melissa finally gets home, she's tired and annoyed. She doesn't know how Jen, a mother of two, got in and out of the mall so quickly. Oh well, maybe next time. Hunt for sales, not parking.